Hey guys. Hey. We're going. Yep. Hello. We're kicking it off. We're getting moving today. This is yeah, we're getting going. They get all the way back there. Look at her. So yeah, we've had us out here for about five minutes, so she's been ripping and running and playing fetch. Nice. So this is Osa. She's been in the shelter for a few months now. Um, <laughs> I'll project a little louder so they, you all can hear me. But um, she's a she's a high energy dog, so she would definitely uh, benefit from a family that's pretty that's that likes to stay active, that has a backyard that can let her go and rip and run around, or at least can take her out for for many walks. Um, she's very playful. She's um. Quite trainable, pretty tree motivated. Hey, Osa. Hey. She's beautiful. Oh my goodness. Yeah, I know. Here we go again. They do. I know. I'm never tired. There it goes. And when you how old is Osa? About a year and a half. So she's about a year and a half. Um, she does really well with other dogs. We've introduced her to quite a few here, and like I haven't had an issue. She plays a little rough, so you definitely would want a dog that can kind of match her energy. But she she plays very well, and she never like takes it overboard. So um, she would definitely do well with them and benefit from having another dog that can kind of uh, help stave off some of her energy as well. Um, she um, would probably be best, she would be best with kids around like 12 years and older just because she can be hyperactive. So you wanna, um, you would want her around like young kids that, that she may be able to jump on. And um, she would do fine, but um, you just would have to watch her energy around the younger kids. So she's really sweet. As you can see, she's relaxing, she's chilling. Yeah, so. she's awesome and gorgeous. She's been here since right before Christmas, well, mid, mid December. Mid December. Yeah, she was a stray and her finder had her for seven, eight days. You want to, I see. She's so good, look at her. Cute. Adorable. Yeah. Maybe we can see if she'll play fetch for us. Maybe, I'll let her run. <laughs> Super quick. Look at her. <laughs> Love it. Thank you for telling us all about her. No Appreciate yeah. it. Hopefully, Hopefully we can get her. Oof. Where did she go? She so definitely quick. deserves it. So, just like the rest of our dogs. 50% Yes, we have our yeah. puppy bowl adoption event. So our um, all of our pets, all of our adoptable dogs, cats. We have four bonded pairs of guinea pigs right now also. Oh, wow. um, <laughs> so all of our pets are gonna be 50% off and um, thankful. We're very, very thankful to West Houston Subaru for sponsoring those adoption fees. Help all these guys get homes. So we're gonna head inside. Okay. We're gonna see all the other dogs that we have up for adoption. Bear with us just a minute while we head in. It is so gorgeous today outside. It's been nice being out here meeting Osa. Don't forget our feral cat clothing drive is continuing through the end of February. Good manners Osa. We have big blue bins out in our parking lot to accept any clothing and textile donations that you have. Um, all of those donations will be sorted and processed and we get um, a financial donation per pound. Um, so I think we're up to about 2,000 pounds of clothing so far. Oh wow. Which is pretty good. Yeah, that's great. Um, we get 20 cents per pound. That's great. Yeah, so we're getting up there. That's great. I donated a bag. Thank you. Already, so I have to go through my closet again. Um, Kayla, our wonderful administrative assistant, um, her mom stepped up into high gear and went through her entire block, her neighborhood block, collecting donations and brought in a whole bunch. So we thank her for that. Thank you, Kayla's mom, if you're out there listening. So we are ready for Puppy Bowl. We're going to have a bake sale going on. We have our decorations up here. 
We're gonna have a bake sale. So please definitely get your goodies. Surprise, surprise, our puppy bowl field is up. We filmed some puppies playing on here earlier. We're gonna share that video with you um, tomorrow. It was a lot of fun. Can't wait to share that with you guys. <laughs> so, first we're gonna meet our dogs that are up here in our real life rooms, which are these sweet type rooms. Then we're gonna go into Doggy Domain, see all of our small and medium dogs. Then we're gonna go into Villas and meet all of our large dogs. And then last but not least, we'll head to Puppy Palace so we can see all of our puppies that are up for adoption. Um, if you have any questions along the way, please leave a comment. Trying to think if there's anything else I forgot. As always, <laughs> we do have strays up here at the shelter. If you recognize one, please send the owner our way. We want to reunite them. So please tell everyone you know, head to the shelter this weekend. Okay, here we go, guys. Look at this face. This is Rocky. One and a half year old retriever chow. This is Whiskey. Hey, Whiskey. Whiskey is a three-year-old Australian shark. <laughs> He's actually very well behaved outside of the kennel, but he does get a little um, possessive uh, territorial about his kennel. So that's why he's barking at us. He's actually a really great dog that we treated for heartworms. So you'll notice the two shaved spots on his back. That's from his heartworm treatment. That'll regrow. And so cute. See, there's a bunch of bits. Hi, bud. Cute. Uh, this is a stray. Here's her information. If anyone is looking for her, let us know. She's adorable. I wonder what her name is going to be. Hi. She's cute. Yeah. Very feminine, pretty. Right. Hi. It's not like a small dog. Yeah. Year and a half. She's adorable. Love it. Okay. Don't forget, we always have a lot of great deals and finds in our pet supply shop. So stop by, buy something. Oh my goodness gracious. This dog turned off the light in her run. It's waffles. is a seven month old retriever. I think it's gonna get a little barky, so I might start zooming in on the paperwork for you guys. Yeah, they're feeding in there, so yeah. it's noisy. Super loud. This dog, I cannot believe it's still here. Nine month old Rottweiler named Pantera. Hey, pretty girl. Oh, pretty girl. 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 Hey, girl. <laughs> <laughs> She's hilarious. I the hot wire. Very animated. Oh, they have such funny personalities. So funny. They show up even more when you get home. Yeah. Than here. Their personalities. Years ago, I picked up a stray Rottweiler. Oh, wow. Um, yeah, I don't... I mean, of course, you know, you want to pick up a stray and help it. Um, the only space I had was in the front seat of my car. <laughs> um, so we got down the road, and uh, we looked at each other and realized this is a very odd situation. Like, she's, like, 
who are you and why am I in your car? In the front seat. Especially. And she's huge. She was a huge Rottweiler. She was like 130 pounds. She was ginormous. And she's sitting eye level with me like, lady, who are you? You know? I was like, I'm sorry. I'm trying to help. This is Tex. Yep, this is Tex. He's a cutie. He is a four-year-old Australian cattle dog. He's a VIP. Tex, we want to see your face, buddy. There we go. Hey, bud. Okay. Okay, so now we're going to go into doggy domain. goodness y'all this is Paco Paco is eight years old hey. he weighs 10 pounds and he's a senior here's his information Sitting. Oh, this is so prissy and polite. Oh, 
Nope, I'm eating my treat. You've seen enough. This guy. Uh, and if you, when you come into the shelter um, this weekend, because I know that you're gonna be here, um, take a look around. You might see some artwork. Um, so we had a lot of the kids from Kids Camp help out with that. So while you're walking around, you can enjoy that too. This is Buster. This is Pepperwork. Okay, you guys ready for the next one? Watch, okay, this is a big reveal. <laughs> they are a work in progress. They are a bonded pair, but they're also a work in progress, so they're not quite available yet. They're super cute, though. <laughs> they are funny. You guys are cute, and you know it. I know. Oh, adorable. Oh, I love this dog. Oh my gosh, I want to squeeze this dog. Um, I think he was just today. neutered yeah. today, so he might be a little bit out of it. Here's oh, and his name is Elvis, which is even better. Oh, guys, are you ready? Check him out. Isn't he perfect? I love the ears. The ears oh are awesome. Oh my goodness. Beagle Basset Hound. Beagle Basset. Bud Bud, let me see your face. He's a bow tie. <laughs> You're ridiculous. Oh my goodness. <laughs> in this picture, his ears like flop on the floor. I know, you gotta see this. Hold on, this is his in <laughs> picture. And his ears were dragging on the ground. <laughs> Too funny. Thank you. I love him. Oh, yeah, he's sweet. Love him. We love you too, Chewy. Hi, Chewy. Chewy's been up for adoption for a while. We did feature him on one of our tours. He's still here. Congratulations to Waldo. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna head to Dog Villas and then we'll be going to Puppy Palace. What is she bathing in there? Oh, I think she has puppies. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta see. 
Because I'm, I'm kind of nosy. Wait a second. What do you have? I have two puppies that I'm about to bathe. <laughs> oh, y'all. Yeah. They are cute. Yeah, about to get their first little baths. First baths, baby's first bath. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> Adorable. Okay, here we go. Yes, they're so cute. Oh, this baby's first bath. Oh, okay, here we go. Back to the tour. Hi, hi, hi. Cuteness and remission. Cute, cute, cute. <laughs> Waffles. Oh my goodness. Okay. Here we go. Puppy bowl. Puppy bowl. Again, we're going to come back to Puppy Palace in just a minute after we see the dogs in Villas. Is there a kitten bowl this year no, surprisingly. So every year there's a puppy bowl and a kitten bowl some weekend. Right. This year Hallmark canceled and there's no kitten bowl oh, this year. Right. So yeah, I don't know why. Huh. Hi. Hi, they're cute, 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 cute. Hi. Hello. This is Mango. Mango doesn't like his cage, but he's pretty calm outside of it. Like he's for what you would expect. Yeah. He's cute. I like him. Yeah. I keep thinking it's a girl, but it's a boy. This is Forrest. Yeah. Forrest is quite active. Needs a little training. He's a good guy. Good girl or guy? Girl. Girl. Good girl. I know, I keep getting these two mixed up. <laughs> Probably because I have a friend named Forrest and a guy. Uh, uh, I don't know, so I keep yeah. getting these it two mixed either. up. It could be either. Both names could be either. That's the same. Okay. This cutie here is a stray. Hold on, let me show you the paperwork. There we go. Spade with a chip. Oh. Uh, the chip information is not current or something. When he stood like that one. When he stood up, his face is different than I expected. It's more like retriever <laughs> yeah. than shepherd. Very retrievery. That's cute. Okay. This is Coco, aka Rainbow. Hi. You look like your name would be Coco. Chocolate brown. Very pretty. Loves people. Loves people. Loves, loves, loves kids. Loves. Just like. Super friendly? Yeah, like gets so excited when people meet with them in a room. Just very friendly. Franklin. This dog. He's a newbie. Franklin. He's a one year old German Shepherd. Hi. Look at his eyes. I know. The blue. Hi. Hi. Oh so my gosh. Pretty. He looks so intense. Just arrived a couple days ago or a day ago. So cute. Falcon and Ruth. This is now their home. As you can see, we've um, started decorating it. Here's their Christmas photo. They're still here. They've been here since August. Guys, we got to get these dogs a home. <laughs> Help us out. If you know of anyone that wants two dogs together, it's a really great idea. A bonded pair. You get a, like, Insta, you get instant friends. family. Yeah. Right. There you go. So these two dogs. This is Falcon and Ruth. That's Ruth. Um, they need to be adopted together. That's Ruthie. She's the best. Yeah, as you can see, they're taking up two kennels. So if we could do this one adoption, it would free up two kennels and we could help two more dogs. Right. With one adoption. Exactly. Oh, gotta find them at home. Bella, this is Bella. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Super cute. Very calm. She is. She's and like her kennel is not trashed. Yeah, she's always up there. Yeah. Even when all the other dogs are barking, she's yeah. just chilling. This is 
back. <laughs> Buck is a one-year-old retriever chow. Super intelligent dog. Very, very smart guy. Likes to play fetch, run in the pond. This is Scooby. Scooby's a two and a half year old shepherd mix. Hey Scoop. Let's see if we can get him looking at the camera. Scooby. Scooby loves people. He's a little calmer than some of them back he here. Another brindley girl here. This is Emily. Emily, look at that smile. She's got a great smile. Yeah. Hey, sweetie. <laughs> just like goofy. Yeah, she's, she's just, just happy. Yeah, she's, she's like happy. She just want to smile. She just wants to smile. Hi. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. She's All very good. intense too, but in like a great way, you know, like she's very intensely happy. Yes. <laughs> All's good in the world. <laughs> this is Baxter. Baxter is a seven month old. Face. It's kind of hard to get a good look at her. She's cute. Oh, there we go. She's also another quiet, well chill behaved. one. Yeah, well behaved, even when all the other dogs are barking. Yeah. Super cute. Um, this baby we passed on the way in. Somebody was looking at him. Thank you. Husky. Yeah, a little shy right now. A little shy. Just Getting used to it. Getting used to it. Okay, now we're gonna go to Puppy Palace. See all of our puppies. Um, we have this little critter also, a little hamster who needs a home. Got a little bit of everything. Here we go. Puppy, puppy, puppies. Puppy, puppy, puppies. Puppy, puppies. There's one here, mystery puppy at surgery today. These two are super cute. They were awake earlier, and now they're passed out. This is because they ate. Yeah, they're all tired. Yeah, they're all <laughs> Nap time. Hi. Let's wake you guys up. Come here. Hi. <laughs> Super cute. Okay. And this is Pee Wee. Oh, the black ones. Yeah, the black, puppies. black puppies. I thought they were from the same litter at first, but I don't think they are. Cute. I got this cutie. This is. So, hey, hi. Do you smile? I think you smile. Hello. Hello. You're very cute. I know you do smile. I see it. Hey, buddy. Hello. Don't oh, jinx it. What are you I doing? Know, sorry. Today? Sorry. <laughs> all just this is Goober. He has the button now for her. Oh. He's cute. He looks like a Goober. He does. Yep. Very fitting name. This cutie here is a stray. If you recognize this dog, please let us know.
This cutie here is probably, I think personally, the cutest puppy that we have. This is Hope. She's absolutely adorable. Let's see if we can get a good look at her. Oh, come on camera. Oh, of course, as soon as it focuses, she goes to sleep. Fantastic. <laughs> She's so cute. This is another stray. Super cute. And then we have this big guy. This is Barney. Barney's a black mouth cur puppy. He's about three months old. He's extra big, so as you can see, we've had to reinforce his kennel a little bit more because he's just that big. Oh, yeah. There you go. He's going to be a big boy when he's grown up. I wonder if they came to both pups. Yeah, but he's so much bigger. Like, he's yeah. huge. So big. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. True. It's true. Maybe, yeah. Uh, maybe one took after the mom and one took after the baby. And then these two, these guys are strays. They are super cute. They are also the puppies that are in our puppy bowl uh -huh. video. They predicted the winner of the Super Bowl, so we're gonna share that with you guys tomorrow. Uh -huh. Aren't they adorable? I'm not going to tell you who they think is going to win. But if you go by their prediction and you win anything, then you have to give part of the proceeds to the shelter. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> That's right. Super cute. Okay, that's everyone today. Hi, oh, you're awake. Hello. Hello. That is everyone. Thank you, guys. For joining the tour stop by this weekend for our 50 percent off puppy bowl adoption event saturday and sunday we'll have a bake sale both days it'll be fun stop by and adopt thank you guys have a great weekend